I'm wearing the Sierra Designs Women's Sierra Jacket. This is the perfect lightweight down puffy for when the temps drop. It's a trusty jacket on its own, but it can be layered with a shell over top in nasty weather. It's filled with high quality 800 fill power down, and there's a good amount of fill in here. You can feel confident wearing it on short stints in a light rain or on misty mornings because it's dry down. Dry down is a treatment that's applied to the down plumes to resist moisture. It stays dry 10 times longer. It dries out 30% faster than traditional down. Down is warm because the plumes are so lofty and they trap in your body heat. Dry down keeps you warmer because the plumes retain two times more loft than untreated down when they get wet. This is an essential feature for me, especially in rainy conditions. The face fabric is strong enough to hold up to some scrapes from brush, but it's lightweight enough to not weigh you down. It's 40D shadow rip polyester, and the inner liner is super soft and feels great next to skin. For features, you get two hand warmer pockets, one where you can stash the jacket inside and you have another secret pocket up top at the chest for a lip balm. There's a stretchy dump pocket inside for an extra pair of gloves, but my favorite feature is the inside of the cuffs. There's a mini sleeve that traps in heat so you don't lose warmth. They're super cozy and stretchy and you can still pull up your sleeves when lighting your stove or checking your watch. The fit is excellent here. I'm wearing a small and it fits pretty well. If I were to layer underneath of it more, I'd probably size up to the medium. The sleeves are long enough, so you're not left with cold wrists. There's a draw cord at the hem, but I find that the length of the jacket is perfect that I don't need to use that cinch unless I'm wearing a backpack with a hip belt. This jacket checks off all the boxes for me. Fit, feel, warmth, and weight. It's the Sierra Designs Women's Sierra Jacket. Thanks for watching. If you have additional questions about the gear you just saw, please feel free to visit backcountryedge.com and get in touch with me or one of our other gear specialists. We also have technical specs about that gear on the product pages of our website, and oftentimes we have bonus videos. If you like our channel, please subscribe.